so I think we have come a long way uh, the last uh, 50 years um, uh, in, in terms of the space technology. Uh, I would I would mention three things that come directly to mind when somebody mentioned about uh, space technologies uh, and exploration. Um, one is, of course, satellites, uh, the telecommunication satellites that um, we can use these days to um, to monitor the weather and provide uh, coverage around the world. Um, then uh, uh, the other thing is uh, computers. Um, I'm not sure uh, how many uh, people know that uh, the, the 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 urge to build a smaller and faster and more efficient computers uh, that eventually led to laptops and your iPhone on, on your on your hand. It was motivated by uh, the space program where we wanted to build small computers to be uh, to be put in space. You know, the problem, of course, in space is that the heavy things are not very good. So you want to build things that are, are light as possible and efficient as possible. So it was a big drive. Um, during the 60s to develop computers. And I think, of course, that led uh, to, you know, try to miniaturize computers using integrated circuits and stuff like that. And of course, that uh, had an impact to the whole society. Uh, navigation algorithms, uh, specifically, I have uh, in mind caramel filtering, um, which uh, was one of the techniques that it was developed uh, to, to, to send the, uh, uh, the lunar module to, to the moon for the landing. Um, so uh, these these algorithms are used today for navigation and GPS, um, and in general, I think what has happened in the last five decades is that all these technologies that have uh, sparked the creation of a new ecosystem of private industry these days. Uh, people know SpaceX, Blue Origin, there are many others out there. Where now we can create technologies uh, that. Uh, who will help um, benefit uh, society, not just uh, you know big governments. Uh, so uh, you see these days, not only NASA. Only NASA is still a big player, but uh, I think there are a lot of other uh, private companies that develop services and products. Uh, and I think in the foreseeable future, what you're going to see is that the space space is not going to be just uh, uh, the playground of. Uh, one or two big uh, government uh, agencies or, or, or countries are a lot of a lot of companies.